Welcome back to H3 Weapon Deep Dive. Oh, you thought the Calibri was the only oversized 1911 in the game. Nope. This is the M1911A1 oversized, ever so slightly oversized. It's got a gigantic bipod. It's got a handle here. It's got a... It's got a slide... slide handle. Because you need that. It's got another one here. You can grab it left-handed, I guess. Oh, no, that's the actual grabbing part. Here's your, uh... Where's my magazine? Here's my magazine. What does it fire here? 45 ACP. Oversized. No problem. Let's check this thing out. Let's check out the controls. We've got two grips here. This one operates the slide. This one is our... Uh, grip as opposed to this thing which you could maybe bear hug but uh, couldn't really hold it by that and a third one here for control when firing so oh got a clicky clicky for the bipod because you're going to need it if you want to get down on the ground and shoot this thing I'm going to shoot this from the air though there we go does it have a hammer cock no does it have a hammer decock no does it have a safety? No. Does it have a slide lock? No. So no slide release either. Uh, okay, so does it have a magazine? Yes, you have to uh, spawn lock these in the shoulder slots because they're so freaking huge. There we go. All right, slide. Simple as that. Hammer's cocked, ready to fire. There you go. Oh, did I mention it's fully automatic? Yeah, it's fully automatic. We hold down the button. We hold down the trigger, rather. Uh, it's fully automatic. Slide will lock back on empty, but again, there is no slide release. So, well, I guess there is a slide lock. Well, the slide lock control doesn't work. So, there's that, I suppose. Let's see if we can... Oh, down on the trackpad. No, down on the trackpad does not eject the magazine. How do you get this damn thing out? What is going on with the controls here? Is my controller even working? There we go. Magazine release is where the safety would be. <laughs> you learn something new every day. There we go. Let's try that again. There we go. You know, it's different than the Colibri. I was expecting some more similarity to the Colibri, but nope. So, pull back. Release is a slide lock. Forward, and now we're ready again. Yes, it is fully... Automatic. Oh, there is a slide release. You just gotta click here on the slide lock. Uh, check out attachments. Oh boy, okay, let's see. Uh, do we have any rails on it? Actually, we do. We got a rail on the left side here. There's a baby rail here. Oh yeah, you can actually stick stuff there. On that rail, you cannot take these grips off, however. And it looks like you've got a rail on the bottom as well. Look at that. That's going to be handy. And on the right side, no, I don't see anything on the right side. So, we've got a bottom and a left. Oh my god, this thing is ridiculous. Let's see what we go on the barrel. Muzzle brake. Oh, well, that's interesting. A muzzle brake. Will not go. Suppressor. Will not will not go. Excuse me. Barrel extension. Nope. And rail adapter. Which might be nice. No, that will not go. Battle spatula. Oh, that's a bummer. Oh, that is a bummer. Stock. Can you can you put a stock on this guy? No, not looking great for attachments other than the rails. So we got some good rails. But looks like that's about it. So we can put an optic on the side, maybe. Let's get that going. There you go. And uh, another foregrip. Ah, yes. Yeah. So if this one's inconvenient, you can get this one going. So actually, which, which one works better for that site? Now, nah, this one's pretty good for that optic. Uh, this one's not too bad, though. But... Uh, 
I'll take that one off for now. There you go. Let's check out the sights. Uh, <laughs> there are sights on this. Let's see if I can hit anything with that. No. Oh, oh God. This is not good. Ugh, right in the face. All right, horizontally it's looking good, but I got to arc this sucker because the velocity is low. Yeah. These aren't very useful for anything at range. But let's see what we can do with the optic I mounted on there. The LPVO. Yeah, it's not really going to help you much. In fact, I'd probably back off the magnification because you're going to have to arc it up so high. Yeah, what, what, what this needs is a uh, grenade launcher sights, a ladder sight on it. That would work great. If we had attachable ladder sights like that, that would be, that would be handy. All right, let's uh, try for some accuracy. Let's see if I can hit that target out there at 100 meters. Okay. Did I get it first try? I look... Yeah, it's gone! Nice job! Big area of effect helps a lot. Well, there you have it, the M1911 oversized. Till next... Whoa! Excuse me. Till next time. I will see ya. Ooh, big boom! Portable artillery. Oh, nice landing.